In your local lakes and ponds, ducks are leading a love life that twists and turns in the most unexpected ways. Let's take a look at the weird and frankly dark ways the ducks pass on their genes. Ducks have a mating game that's as complex as it is intriguing. The males, known as drakes, go to great lengths to catch the eye of their potential partners, engaging in elaborate displays and dances. However, the meat of our story lies within their anatomy. The male's reproductive organ is a corkscrew-shaped wonder, perfectly complemented by the female's opposite corkscrew-shaped reproductive tract. The female's reproductive system has evolved to be a labyrinth, complete with many dead ends and twists to thwart less desirable mates. This design not only challenges the persistence of the drakes, but also empowers the females to selectively choose the father of their offspring. Unfortunately, this is a necessary trait, as ducks engage in what scientists call forced copulations, which, frankly, aren't the hallmark of consent. It's a wild, sometimes chaotic scene that plays out in waters worldwide. And while it might not be the fairy tale romance you'd imagine, it's nature's way of ensuring the survival of the fittest, or in this case, the most persistent. After the water calms and the splashes settle, the female duck takes charge. She'll choose where to lay and hide her eggs, making all the decisions about the next generation's upbringing. In the end, it's her resilience and care that keep the duck dynasty going, 